Welcome to the Comlex Minute. Visit www.comlexflashcards.com for a complete lecture. Today's review topic is febrile seizures. And it's important to understand the definition of febrile seizures before answering questions on the Comlex. According to the National Institutes of Health, a consensus statement showed that a febrile seizure is an event in infancy or in childhood, usually occurring between three months and five years of age. It's associated with fever, but without any evidence of intracranial infection or defined cause for the seizure. This rarely develops into epilepsy. And in terms of symptoms, patients usually have a seizure history of tonic-clonic seizures generally lasting less than 10 minutes and a drowsy post-ictal state. Um, you also want to pay attention to the temperature. Children with a seizure at peak temperature um, less than 38.9 degrees Celsius um, tend to present with a complex febrile seizure. Um, these peak temperatures may be related to the recurrence risk. Um, and these seizures generally occur during a rise in the temperature and not at the peak of the temperature. Um, prolonged seizures lasting greater than 15 minutes usually clues you into an infection or um, any kind of a toxic condition and it should be worked up for. On physical exam, it's important to check the neck for any meningeal signs. Um, and you want to look at the skin for any rashes or petechiae. And on your HEENT exam, you should check the fontanelle and make sure there's no depression, bulging, or pulsatile patterns, as well as check the cranial sutures. In order to make the diagnosis, should you order an EEG study? Well, an EEG study is usually not indicated unless there's unexplained encephalopathy. Um, in order to make the diagnosis, you need three things. You need the age, you need fever, and you need a seizure. You also want to consider getting electrolytes, glucose, calcium, and a urinalysis. Lumbar puncture and blood culture are also um, indicated if there's clinical signs on your physical exam in order to rule out meningitis. In terms of the treatment, generally there's no treatment that's needed for the simple simple febrile seizure. Um, for fever, administer antipyretics like acetaminophen or ibuprofen. Um, although, you know, they're not shown to prevent febrile seizures or any recurrences. And these are the references from the American Academy of Pediatrics. As always, thank you for listening and visit www.comlexflashcards.com for a complete lecture. Wish you all the best in your board preparation for the Comlex.